Martin Luther King Magnet is one of the highest achieving high schools in Nashville, but it's also a school in need of repair. You can see the conditions of the walls. Principal Shun Turner gave us a quick tour, highlighting bad odors and problems that extend from floor to ceiling. Students say they succeed in spite of the building. They need to at least come in and try and fix the basic problems. This school was built in 1936 and problems have existed for years. Parents say they are beyond frustrated. Ceiling tiles that are falling down, the exposed pipes. Parents held a meeting with Metro Schools maintenance and facilities leaders asking for an update on improvements and renovations. It needs to really be recognized that there's some really serious issues that need to be, you know, taken care of. The building needs $9 million worth of repairs, but they're not likely to happen until at least 2015. Surprisingly, despite the conditions here, among all Metro Schools, MLK is 44th on the district's priority list. These pictures are from other metro schools in worse shape. In the, the next 10 years looking out, we had estimated 1.2 billion. And again, that doesn't fix every problem. That fix the ones that, that we've looked at and they're rising toward the, being the more critical. But there's one problem that many say needs to be fixed now. Rodents who walk the hallways along with MLK students. We joke about trying to let cats loose in the school to try and catch the mice and the rats and that there would be a fat and happy cat. John Dunn, Fox 17 News.